G'day my friends, Marty Ware here from the Marty's Garden Show and today we're talking about the compost pods and collecting harvesting from my humus layer compost. Now these, you wouldn't believe it, are all wood chips and everything, all broken down by the worms. Now this is very humusy and full of energy and bio life. It's just insane that they can go through this in about two weeks. Now there was 10,000 worms here, there's still probably quite, probably about 3,000 left. I'm harvesting from both bins at the moment We've got it here, and look, this type of casting that's made from wood chip and leaf mould and things, uh, it's really, really very good. Obviously, we put the other grains in there to feed the worms as well, and a little bit of cow manure, a little bit of mushroom compost, but it's basically about the humus. All that energy from the sun is captured, all that energy from the sun is captured into these castings and then eaten and turning, turned into virtually a pH neutral compost which ends up in one of these bags and then what we do is we add into these bags some extra micronutrients so we put some rock minerals in there and some chelated minerals and things and then you've got the worm castings in there so when you drop it in your bucket it's full of nutrients and full of life and these are really great you just put them underneath your tree you can put them in your watering bucket like I have uh, here which this one's done you can see in there it's a little bit darkish that's probably up to about its 50th litre at the moment. They just go in there and hang in there and tie in there like that. And you just keep on using them. These are really great. But it's all about what's going into them and what's going into the casting. So we get a good look here. You can just see how beautiful black and rich they are. And look, there's, look, there's an egg there, two eggs. There you see my thumb pointing. And we're, I'm gonna save those eggs and take them over to the worm farm as we speak. So if Karen walks around behind the wheelbarrow here, and these are my worm farms here, some other ones where I've got them specially breeding. I'm going to drop those eggs into there. And then I'm going to show you how well these castings are growing some food. Now, a friend of mine said, how do you test all this stuff? You know, it takes a year to know. And well, I said, well, you can do it with microgreens. And look at that. Rocket microgreens about one week old. And it's just like a sea of green. And that's pretty much ready to go now. I can just open that up and leave that out. They're ready to go. Ready to harvest, pretty much ready to eat. So anyway, we've got these castings here. I've already collected about 20 litres. And we've probably got in here about another 30 litres in this box here. And we're going to head around to the compost pile and sift it into this well, this was actually donated to me, this wheelbarrow. So into the wheelbarrow and off we go, shall we? Camera still running? Yeah. Still running, cool. Well, this is the compost pile here. And over here, this is like a big sourdough mix, you know, where you mix your, your, your sourdough blend into your sourdough to keep it going, the 11 or something I think they call it, or the culture. And if we come around here, Karen, you can see, I've been, the worms are breeding up in here and they're so, she's got to walk around the wheelbarrow. Come in close and I'll stand on this side, Karen. So, I've got this little marker there. So if we look now, see some worms falling out there? You see them, Karen? Oh, there's one. They're all falling out here. They're all through this mix, and uh, I don't want to disturb them too much. They go in there, mate. They're coming up to the top and laying eggs, and this is basically the bio life for this. Oh, look. Get back in there, little fella. Okay. This is basically all the bio life that I'm building, and parts of this always go into the, fir the farms and different things, so that biology just start keeps on going and keeps on getting better and better and better. All right, anyway, we need to start screening this stuff now. So what we're going to do is we're going to see how well it screens. And it's screening really, really nicely. So we'll get Karen to come back on the camera in a little while and we'll show you uh, what comes out of this after I screen it through this whole bin here. Okay, so Karen and I were sifting away here and what we're doing is putting it through this sifter and then basically I just shake it through and then if current comes forward you can see here 
Look, he goes a worm, he just escaped. Well, I'm gonna put him back in there. And look at all these eggs. They're just everywhere, all these little golden things. They're all little eggs. And we've got still like 90% broken down. There's some worms in here, and some eggs have gotten through. And look, it's great stuff. It's ready, still ready to use. Just gonna be some more sifting and things going on with that. But this is what we got out of that material, about five liters of really high quality, nutrient dense, bio life, worm castings. Now this stuff is just insane. Like there's little eggs through it everywhere. Look, there's a little egg there. We go through, I've mixed it up a fair bit, but there's literally hundreds of eggs in here. We stopped taking them out because it was just taking way too long to get all the eggs. So I thought, well, I'll just go through this and sift this again separately and get the eggs out such as like that. Because to us really, each, each egg is so valuable, each worm is so valuable because we work in a small space and it's all about creating this beautiful artisan material and using the, quite, the right nutrients such as the rock minerals, uh, different types of foods, uh, providing the right nutrient density and giving them a perfect environment so they create a really, real superior worm casting. And then they eventually go into the compost pods and in the future, I plan to actually be bagging this and selling this type of compost to the public. Now, we're nearly there. The website's very close, uh, only a week to two weeks away. If you want to get a compost pod or you want to find out more about my worm castings and compost, you can get me at the Marty's Garden Show in Facebook. The video, actually the video, I'm not going to say the video. The website's about uh, a week to two weeks away. We've got the truck here, over here. I've just got to put the plates on it, registration, everything's been done. Great little truck, and we're pretty much ready to rock and roll. So stoked to be here, and we're on the micro farm, which I like call my little urban micro farm, on the mid-north coast in North Haven, New South Wales. Spring is here, and it's a beautiful day. So hopefully, I'll hear from you in the near future, and we'll see you at the next video real soon. Bye for now.